Well, I think the biggest challenge that women face uh, in engineering is their perception of what engineering is. Um, I think there's still the perception um, that's been generated over, over generations, I think, uh, about the fact that it's a, a dirty environment, p um, people working in two rooms on production lines. Um, and it's, uh, of course, we've still got tool rooms, which are great, and we've still got uh, uh, people making things, which is fantastic. Um, but the, the, envi the working environment has changed beyond all recognition. And you see that in, in Atkins uh, around the world. So what you get in terms of in uh, China and um, Hong Kong and India, UK, uh, Middle East, uh, America, you see people working in lots of different, very, very um, pleasant environments. And I think that's different. And we've got to get that, we've got to change our perception. The thing that's really impressed me most about Atkins, um, when, I, when I came into the company about five and a half years ago, um, the, the, one of the things that struck me was just the diversity of the things that we do. And in persuading or working um, with in diversity within our organization, lots and lots of things are happening. People are really interested, very committed to trying to persuade and inspire young girls and women um, that engineering is a career for them. Um, so there's lots of things going around. I mean, the National Women in Engineering Day, which is, takes place, as you know, on the 23rd of June, lots and lots of things going around in the UK about what we're doing, about persuading girls and women that there is a real career opportunity in engineering for them. Um, so that's the thing that's really, really impressed me. It's a fantastic career. I've worked in engineering for all of my career, 40 odd years. I've been working in engineering for some great companies, worked with some great people, worked all over the world um, in some great environments on some fantastic projects. Um, and it's, a, it's variety, it's diversity, it's, it's really looking at the doing, making things happen that can impact on the environment, the world that we live in, uh, and making, thing, making it a better place. I know that sounds a little bit patronizing, but it's true. You know, there's lots and lots of things that we are doing in engineering um, that, is, that is really helping the world in terms of the environment that we're living in and the future. Uh, and I just think that we've got to persuade parents, teachers, um, further education, universities, government and industry um, that it isn't just about boys. It's actually how do we persuade and inspire girls to take a real interest in engineering and consider it as a career. It might not be for everybody, I realise that, but I think we'd at least give it a shot, give it some consideration.